right, well, we just started this little hike. Uh, we bedded down those two bucks. They kind of moved over on the opposite side, so we're trying to cut them off by getting up this ridge line to set them out. They've bedded down, but I think we've got a pretty good shot at think so. you know, sitting on them. And if not, there's probably something else up in there, too. Probably. <clears throat> so we got a nice little john ahead of us, and uh, it's all straight up. Yes. <laughs> I just keep looking at the mesquite, and I'm just like, we just got to get to the mesquite. <laughs> so pretty, pretty soon. Hopefully I can shoot straight. You will. You better. <laughs> after this hike. Oh, I know. <laughs> I know. So, well, let's get on up this hill and try not to die. want an elk with a big old frame on him so that's what we're after this one we're gonna let walk it's just just getting started here evening number two muscular let's go see what else we can find It's the morning of uh, day one, and uh, we just took a nice little drive. Had a little siesta in the truck on the drive over here. But uh, the big thing up here is, as you can see, the coos deer are in this mountain stuff. They're not down the desert stuff. They got a lot more hills. And uh, so we got up onto a high point. We're gonna walk out a little bit, do a bunch of glass in this morning. Um, it's cold, obviously, you can tell. I got my beanie on, I'm all bundled up, and I'm still a little chilly, so. What? That keep you warm too. Yeah, I, you have to grow a gri little grizzly on the face. Really helps keep the cheeks and the chin insulated. Good buck. Maybe not a first day shooter, but one to probably consider uh, maybe even tomorrow. That was debatable. How did Vikings survive the daily commute? Meat! Power through with help from the original protein, Jack Link's jerky. Well, we're on uh, day two of our adventure down here in Mexico. Hermano Diablo Corndog and I are on a rotation and uh, he was behind the gun yesterday and so we're doing a trade off. I'm the one behind the gun today. We're back to where we were last night. We saw a pretty good coo steer here just before sundown. And I uh, got some footage of him, glassed him up. We just, we're too far away. We're about what, 1300 yards? Yeah, about 1,300 yards. So we just didn't have the time frame to be able to make a move. So if we're able to find him this morning, we can make a move. Is he still there? Well, he's behind now. He's behind the knob, so... I don't know. I think he's going to keep moving right. Yeah, he's a really good buck. So we're just sitting here glassing up. Beans on one side, I'm on the other. 
Dude, I've been looking there all morning long, and it just so happens this buck pops up. It's a shooter buck, so we're waiting for Enrique to get down here, and we're going to make a move on this son of a gun, so stay with us. He's not Benny Crockett. <laughs> Too close. <laughs> too close, too easy, you know. Need it to be more of a challenge. Need it to be some sort of a shiz show. <laughs> We can throw to you some toys. <laughs> yeah. Make it real fun. It can't, it can't be a normal home without me unless it's an absolute shiz show. You can say shiz on TV, right? Yeah, yeah. Just can't say the other. No. But everyone knows what I'm talking about. They do. That's just how I roll. <laughs> <laughs> Smoothies didn't conquer cities. Meat did. Choose the original protein. Ah. Jack Link's Beef Bars. One right across on top of the costume. And then through the back where I had that. Okay. And then way back. That way down. Good body, but... How you gotta feel me doing okay. stuff like this, corn dog? Yeah, we still speak together. I'm just okay. fixing it. <laughs> I got my hand in cow shit. Now we got a potential shooter buck that we're talking about going to make a move on. So there's two bucks together, a smaller buck and this one. He's okay, he's a funky buck. And uh, it's gonna be a lot of hiking, but we're trying to uh, put together a game plan. And hopefully it comes together. So I think this is the best thing we have going for us. And uh, see what we can do so it's it's gonna be a long haul there's it's, it's not a for sure thing by any means but well, those are three bucks there's there. two bucks over there for you and one for me. let's do it who knows you never know walking up in there there that's what that's how that back side is where we saw those bucks first thing in the morning on the first day uh that we're up in there in the sun and so you never know we could get going do something else up um let's just Pray and hope for a twofer up there. Yeah. All right, well, we just started this little hike. Uh, we bedded down those two bucks. They kind of moved over on the opposite side, so we're trying to cut them off by getting up this ridge line to set them out. They've bedded down, but I think we've got a pretty good shot at think so. you know, sitting on them. And if not, there's probably something else up in there too. Probably. <clears throat> so we got a nice little john ahead of us, and uh, it's all straight up. Yes. <laughs> I just keep hiking hike. at the mesquite, and I'm just like, we just gotta get to the mesquite. <laughs> so pretty, pretty soon. Hopefully, I can shoot straight. You will. You better <laughs> after this hike. Oh, I know. <laughs> I know. So well, let's get on up this hill and try not to die. Okay, he's down. There's another buck. The other one's down? Yeah. Yes. Shh, shh. What about the other one? Are you sure? Yeah. Mine's down, though. Yes, Where's there's another one there? Bug. 
His, I can see his ass. Okay. He's going to be going to the right. Okay. Just patient. He's coming down. He's coming down. Whew, okay. okay. I'm going pretty good. But I'm going to give him a second. I'm ready. <laughs> Woo! Is he down? Yeah. Ha <laughs> ha! Motherfucker, yeah! Alright. Oh my god. Is that the twofer? That's we the just twofer. hit the twofer! <laughs> awesome. <laughs> oh, dude, Cordon, mm. unbelievable, buddy. Enrique, good freaking <laughs> job. <laughs> oh, yeah, oh. Well, we did it. <laughs> Last day of hunt. Who would have freaking sunk, buddy? That's awesome, dude. Oh. What well, were the luck that. Well, it's the luck that he just didn't take off if you shot yours. I, I don't know. That's crazy. I don't know. Both bucks in the same freaking location. We didn't even move the rifle. Mm, I'm still shaking, dude. Like, I mean, it's so funny. Like, before, I'm, like, cold as ice, but now I'm just like, oh, my gosh. Oh my Last God. day. Last day, corn dog. Yeah. And it's freaking, what is it, 130, 130 p.m. The old CT Edge 28 Nas. <laughs> Bean boozles. Gun. Mine got stuck in the US because of licensing things. I messed up and put down the wrong serial number, so I had to leave it in the US. So the Creedmoor had to stay, but the 28 Nosler. The 28 Nas is here to deliver. White yeah, lightning, you. baby. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go find our beer. I'm excited. I just hope it's not a little milk sucker, but <laughs> it doesn't matter at this point. It had antlers. It had antlers. That's all it had. This is going to be a fun hunt. He's, uh, that's a nice looking buck. I mean, for last day, getting her done, that's what, that's what we have. And I'm happy. He's not going anywhere. That is freaking awesome. Enrique, he is a three on both sides. Well, here we are up on the beautiful hilltop here in Old Mexico with Enrique and the twofer. The two coos deer we just hammered and CT Edge uh, with the 28 Nas did the number. Both deer, one shot. We freaking just took it to the old pump station, man. Yes, we did. And we got lucky. <laughs> so I tell you what, it was a rodeo and a half, but uh, we survived the eight seconds. So a couple great bucks. I mean, I couldn't be happier with my coos. I'm you? happy too. I mean, for the last day. <laughs> so Enrique's the man. Punk. Thanks, buddy. Thank you. Okay. Thank, Thank you, you and uh, thanks, dude. Yeah, that was awesome, man. Stay tuned to another job. episode of the Fierce Life. <laughs>